Hi, I am Sanjoy, and in this video, you will learn about JavaScript variables and constants, and also how to initialize and use them with the help of examples. JavaScript variables. In programming, a variable is a container or storage area to hold data. How to declare variables in JavaScript. In JavaScript, we use the var keyword to declare variables. For example, var x. Here, x is a variables. How to initialize variable in JavaScript. We use the assignment operator equals to assign a value to a variable. var x x equals 5. Here, 5 is assigned to variable x. You can also initialize variables during its declaration. var x equals 5. var y equals 6. In JavaScript, it's possible to declare variables in a single statement. var x equals 5, y equals 6, z equals 7. If you use a variable without initializing it, it will have an undefined value. var x x is the name of the variable. alert x will show undefined. Here x is the variable name, and since it does not contain any value, it will be undefined. You will learn about undefined and other data types in the next video in detail. Can you change the value of variables? It's possible to change the value stored in the variable. For example, var x equals 5, alert x will show 5, x equals 3, alert x will show 3. The value of a variable may vary. Hence, the name variable. Rules for naming JavaScript variables. Variable names must start with either a letter, an underscore, or the dollar sign. For example, var a equals hello. var underscore a equals hello. var dollar sign a equals hello. These all are valid declaration of variable. Variable names cannot start with numbers. For example, var 1a equals hello. This gives an error. JavaScript is case sensitive. So, lowercase y and uppercase y are different variables. For example, var lowercase y equals high. Var uppercase y equals 5. Alert lowercase y will show high. Alert uppercase y will show 5. Keywords cannot be used as variable names. For example, var new equals 5 will show error. New is a keyword. Notes. Though you can name variables in any way you want, it's a good practice to give a descriptive variable name. If you are using a variable to store the number of apples, it better to use apples or number of apples rather than x or n. In JavaScript, the variable names are generally written in camel case if it has multiple words. For example, first, name, annual, salary, etc. JavaScript constants. The CONST keyword is used to create constants. For example, CONST x equals 5. Once a constant is initialized, we cannot change its value. CONST x equals 5. x equals 10. Alert x will show error. Constant cannot be changed. Simply, a constant is a type of variable whose value cannot be changed. Also, you cannot declare a constant without initiating it. For example, CONST x will give error. Missing initializer in const declaration. Note, if you are sure that the value of a variable won't change throughout the program, it's recommended to use constant. Now that you know about variables, you will learn about different types of data a variable can store in the next video.